good to see. Wade van Niekerk, well, his personal best, 31.63. He is, remember, the reigning world champion at 400 metres from uh, Beijing last year. LaShawn Merritt, twice world champion over 400 metres, Olympic champion back in 2008. This is a huge race, 300 metres. They will be able to argue, should they not win? Should they not come out on top? Any of these athletes that, well, it's a 300, it's not a 400. That's the distance that really matters. So there's an element of cushioning, I suppose. But obviously one's form over 300 is a mighty powerful indicator of what you can do over 400. And the big names here, Van Niekerk, Merritt, McQuala, will want to get this right. They start, of course, at the beginning of the back straight. Tough distance to get right. A 200, well, you can virtually go flat out for a 200. There has to be an element of control. But uh, 300, well, again, you want the temptation is to go flat out. That uh, world record 30.85 by Michael Johnson was set in Pretoria back in March 2000. I think, Martin, you were in the stadium for that one. Set. So away they go, Van Niekerk then, third to right, moving smoothly. The much bigger figure of LaShawn Merritt, also central picture, up on his toes now and going very strongly. McQuala outside him, who was uh, committed so early in his races with that yellow armband to left of picture. These big three close together. Van Niekerk up on Merritt, up to 200 metres and into the straight. Van Niekerk leans into the bend there, comes into the straight two metres up and Merritt can't get back to him here. Merritt, who's gone under 20 seconds for 200 this year, has looked really strong, but beaten by a metre and a half. The pair of them well clear from the rest. 31-0-3. Well, that is a meeting record as well. And Wade Van Nieker lays down a very, very important pointer there. Perhaps psychologically more important than anything. Says to uh, LaShawn Merritt, you might think you've acquired new speed this year, but I can still take you over 300, son. Tony McQuay coming home in third place, but about three or four metres down. Van Nieker's time has been confirmed at 31.03, and that is the third fastest in history behind Michael Johnson and Usain Bolt. And I think in real terms, it's probably the second fastest because if you consider the benefit that Michael Johnson had when he broke the world record at altitude, almost 6,000 feet at the Pilditch Stadium in Pretoria, a South African here has run what I think is equivalently faster than that. But, uh, well, he's shown there's more to him than just that performance in Beijing last year. He's gone on to break 10 seconds, hasn't he, at uh, 100. He broke 20 seconds for 200 on his way to Beijing. And here he is at 300 metres as well. I think he's got a, a fair claim to be just about the outstanding athlete in the world at the moment. He is utterly dominant. That's a terrific performance. And uh, he's a fairly slight fellow, isn't he? He's not a big man. Compare him with LaShawn Merritt. But he's a lovely fluid sprinter, Martin. Really high knees, great power to weight ratio. 31.03 for Merritt's 31.23. Yes, it was about a metre and a half between the big two. McQuala 